Here we are with Quebec MMA legend David the Crow Loiseau. And uh, listen, some new great news just broke out. It looks like, uh, you know, you're going to be on some TV, not just fighting. Or maybe there's going to be some fighting in this reality show or what? Um, won't be much fighting. I think it's uh, mostly about um, my lifestyle, the, 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 the training, the drama, the the... There's a lot of stuff I can't talk about right now. Right. But it's gonna it's it's a reality show. It'll, it'll be very interesting. I'll be traveling around um, um, Canada and the United States, training with different people and training different people. It'll be very interesting. And you know, are you looking at any of these type of current reality shows as kind of a model? Are they gonna try and tell you, yeah, go beat up Snooky or something like that? Maybe not Snooky, but he's trying to you know find Pauly D or these Jersey Shore guys. Are you gonna do your own thing? Um. I mean, I will do my own thing, you know, but uh, I'm not trying to go crazy and do stupid things to get attention. But obviously, you know, drama will, uh, <laughs> will <laughs> there will be some drama on the reality show for sure. Yeah. Now, are, are you going to use this as a form to maybe address certain issues that might be going on? Like if people got some questions about uh, the UFC career, if you're going to go back, if you can talk about defending uh, your current, you know, your current MMA career, your current championship. Uh, what are your uh, thoughts and plans for that going on right now? Oh, it's, it's not about um, um, my career. It's about the, the lifestyle of a mixed martial arts fighter, you know, and, and uh, uh, the ups and downs and everything else. It, it's not has nothing to do with the career itself, no. And how much did the striking truth, maybe, and going through that experience get you thinking about Hollywood and trying to, you know, do this reality show? What, what motivated you? Was the striking truth or something else? Oh, I, I was approached. It wasn't my idea. The striking truth was my idea, but the reality show thing, I was when I was approached to do it, I was like, ah, I wasn't too um, too hyped about it. But you know, it's a it's a great project. Uh, um, the company doing it, producing it, is the the KF Distry Group, and um, they're based out of New York. So uh, I'm just looking forward to uh, to making it happen, to, to having a great season. Yeah, and uh, any thoughts about how many episodes? You can you talk about that? How many episodes might be released, and uh, and where it's going to be uh, aired? Um, not yet. I can't tell. It's too early. We're really early, you know. Okay, and the title is going to be Crow TV. No, no, no. Crow time. Crow time. Crow Time Reality Series. There you go. A uh, little message out there for all the fans and, and uh, that have supported you for this long illustrious career that you've had. A little shout out to them, and what can they, what they can expect from Crow Time. Well, I mean, thank you for your support. Um, I'm, I'm, I'm here to stay. You know, I'm, I had a, a few, I had actually two knee surgeries um, in three months one, uh, at the end of uh, 2011. And um, I'm doing way better now, still doing, uh, working on the physio and uh, getting my legs uh, strong again. But uh, I should be back, be ready to fight in, in a few months. So just uh, keep following me. I'm, uh, I'll be around for a while. All right, this is David the Crawler Wazo here on the way in. <laughs>